Welcome back, everyone, to an episode of Thronefall with me, Dr. Munchkin. So, last time, if you've been following along, we, uh, we've been handling the official release. Uh, there's three new levels here, which is amazing, and we've been working on Morwig, which uh, brings in the dead and a bit of a crypt and other things that we were contending with. But last time, we went ahead and completed both A and B quests, because we used the commander mode. We also did a crazy just berserkers up the wazoo. But today, what we're going to work on doing is if I remove all this, we want to do option D. Now, we can do option C later, it just gives you less gold. That's fine. But we got a new weapon. We got the Battle Axe. And so I want to try this guy out, and we at least need to have warrior training on so my weapon gets more powerful. So now the question is, we have four more perks because they increased it to a total of five. What else do we want? I'm feeling this so you and your units and all your buildings start with more melee damage, which is nice. So I get more melee damage and I get stronger throughout the night. Solid. Um, don't need the healing towers. I will get my health regen, though. I'm going to get heavy armor because I'm going to be in the thick of it. And if we read this, I do splash damage in a small radius. I have health steal, and I deal bonus damage to siege engines. Gain temporary shield, double protect me from all damage. That's really nice. <laughs> I like it. Maybe I don't need this because I have the healing. This with magic armor though should be amazing. So let's actually forgo that. I don't think I want fortified houses. And I know there was a lot of melee people, especially the thing. I do need some economy. We do have a harbor there, so let's just grab the harbor for the economy, and we need one more. Do I want to do research? I could do easier research. That could benefit us, or faster research. Um, they're not really going to get to the research building unless I spawn the little summoning circles to get more gold, which we will do. Faster, we need one more. No? Collecting coins heals me? I still like this one. I know last time I was like, ah, don't do that. But, you know, it's kind of nice. You know, we'll do this. We'll do active cooldown. Oops. Um, just so I can pop this bubble more. We haven't used it, so I don't know how this is going to go, but we're giving it a shot. So if you enjoyed this content, please make sure you guys like and subscribe. With that, let's go ahead and start. Alrighty, let's go ahead and build this castle. Now, these guys are going to come in. I am going to want to get the shrine online. We're going to go do this to try to help. I am going to go ahead and start trying to do research as well. And I want more melee attack. Not only for me, but for the troops I'm going to build. And we'll start to try to get some economy. I don't have... I can't spend anything else, so we're just going to wait. Now, we don't have a score requirement, so we can kind of wait for these guys to come in as needed. Now, they are ranged, which is not great. But once they are kind of uh, here, we should be able to... Bring them in a little closer so they get shot by the set tower. There we go. And oh, that is our shield, and we have the life steal, which is amazing. So we've made good progress on this, which is happiness for me. The question is where are they coming from next? We got ghosts from down below think they go right through things, but we will take care of them. Alright, so that's being researched. Check. Let's try to get... Do we have units online yet? I don't believe we got units online until later. We could also try this shrine. I think we do this. We do this shrine, and then we also try to do... We do magic armor because we have all that increased health. And we want them to come all the way into here. So hopefully we can hopefully complete this one and maybe get some progress on that. We can try to get that one later too. Um, last time when we played this, if you recall, they 
pierce pretty heavily into the main complex there. But this gives us gold. It's part of our economy, but it also gives us defense, which is amazing. So I'm gonna try to grab them to come up here. Except I am not doing like any damage to this guy. There we go. There we go. Bring him over here a little bit. Pop that. Alright, so we survive. Ever so slightly. These guys are tough. I didn't realize how tough these guys were. But we got both shrines online. So that's a good thing to note. Yeah, we're going to need some actual troopage. We have a thing coming in as well. Um, this is a normal barracks. We're just going to go ahead and get some berserkers online because I like them. That still has the data research. That's fine. Uh, those are online. I could get some archers as well. I have eight. What do we want to spend things on? I think he comes down this way. We're going to spend here. Put you guys there. And then... You know, I'll at least grab this southern one. I know it's just three and we're going to build a house. Because we do need... Oh no, I was a fool! Alright, we'll get it next time. I need that harbor online. Which way are you coming, big guy? They're chunking pretty hard. The problem is, like, you see these murders everybody. There we go. This is where we want to have our stand to try to activate this shrine. I don't know how much these guys actually do because they have so much health. It's a battle of attrition here. liking the potion build we had last time, just because I'm healing my guys. I like how he's trying to find another route to go. Probably should have purchased those archers. I mean, we got this, don't get me wrong, and we don't care about score too much. If this activates the shrine, though, that's just free money, and it makes this battle of attrition worth it. Can I fuck oh, it did activate it. That's amazing. Okay, so we got that. First things first, we definitely want to get economy online over here, like that. Um, we could upgrade all the way. Um, maybe we do that, maybe we don't. Or I need more research as well. Yeah, we'll do this. Okay, so more melee damage for you and your units. Three days to research or resistance. We'll do the damage, so we do even more damage. And then I will build three houses. Oh, well, we'll build that tower because apparently I wanted a tower. Um, hopefully they come this way. Well, we have these two guys up and ready to go. Spiders should not be that big of a problem for us. The thing is, I need flail guys to really make this work. Now they get stronger as we move along, which is why I need to get something working here. I'm getting stronger too, is why I'm doing all the research. And 
because I'm building myself as a tank character, I do want to get that ability that allows me to effectively go in and do 25% damage to them to start with. There we go. Alright. That was clean. And we're starting to get things online. More boats. That is a big wave. I'm not terribly concerned about it. We're going to go ahead and upgrade you, though. And then I have that. We will try to activate this guy. And then I'm just going to bring in more berserkers as well. Keep oops. Don't know how well that's going to work. I mean, the berserkers are murdering. And siege engines stand no chance. So we're trying to build an economy. <laughs> this doesn't seem too bad. These guys are annoying. Um, we'll go ahead and get some archers now. I think I'll go with the the hunters. We'll just leave them there. I have 23. That's all upgraded. Let's go ahead and spend some gear. Do I want more health? And no. I think I'll do that for just more damage for me. We'll do that. We need to start upgrading our houses. Or not houses. These guys. You'll be a sniper tower though, because you're in the back. And I have a little bit more. I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to put this guy there. Um, and put you guys there. So these should help defend the south. This guy should shoot. Oh crap, forgot. There's a wall that needs to go over here. Well, if I can trap all of them, this is great. They're hurting themselves as well as trying to hurt me. There's a wall that can go there. These guys get stuck too. This would be perfect. It seems that if you look in the bottom right over here, um, all the other guys are taken care of. It's just this little bit, and I have a shield and enough armor to tank all of this. Hence why I didn't want to go for the the other upgrade. All right, that's more money. We got two things there, two things there. I would like to get that online, don't believe we will be able to. Um, we'll go ahead and add you. Make you... We'll make you a bunker tower, so if anything gets close to this wall, you start to like really shoot it. We are going to go ahead and try to upgrade all the way. And this is what I was talking about. When your character hits, um, they instantly lose 25% of their health. So that's what we want there. Now in terms of more upgrades, what else do we want? Uh, those are, you know, we'll just add some more hunters over here, like that, actually, we'll grab all three of them, or not three, <laughs> all eight of them, because there's eight of those guys, and then I need to find out, there it is, more barracks. Now this one, I'm actually going to go for flails. And all these guys, come over here, like that, and I'm going to come in and try to help so there's a huge, huge bit. Now all my guys are going to die real fast. It's not the end of the world. What I kind of want is them to get into range of... Yes! That thing. Right. Now 
they're coming up here, it's fine, but these guys have not been hit by me. Now they should maybe try to go around. Yep. Melee troops are not doing so. I think I need to get melee resistance next as the tier 3 upgrade. Whenever that is, it is complete. We'll go ahead and get some melee resistance online like that. Now, these guys are a pain in my butt. It's not the end of the world. I'll grab a house just for house's sake. Um, I am going to upgrade these walls though. And I will go ahead and just put that wall in there. It will be weak, but that is okay. And I do want to upgrade these guys. So we're going to grab these, put you guys here. Grab all you guys and put you guys here. Now this is going to be a big wave. Now we do have some defenses and my ability here, uh, or rather the damage that I do, should help immensely. Uh, we need to pivot you guys behind the wall. Don't know that. I think these guys can go through it though. Is that correct? Yeah, I think they just go through the wall. Activate our ability here. This tower obviously is getting faster, 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 which is why we did what we did. We do have the turrets though online, we do have more towers back behind, and they haven't destroyed any of our troopage, so we should be solid at least for the wave. And these are indestructible to the shrines. But as they get closer, we probably might have been able to activate that one had we let them in farther, but there's a risk that I don't believe. Oh no, they're not going to get over there. That's a piece of I guess. There we go. That should clean that up nice. Alright, so we just lost a tower and a wall. This is a bigger wave. Now this has flying enemies. Which is not good. We're just going to grab these guys go. Put you guys here. Like that. Grab all you guys. And put you here like that, just so we're trying to cover all our bases. Um, do I want to activate that one? I do not know. The bombs are going to be annoying. I think we do that, try to handle the southern area. In response to that, we should probably do that as well. Um, We'll try to get this shrine online. Hopefully they come down far enough. Uh, that'll help later when we do the whole entourage thing. And then I'm going to want... We're getting our boats in. We're getting that in. I should be doing more damage, which is good. All right, I just want more damage. Now this is the shrine thing we could actually do. All of your units are sacrificed at the beginning of the night. Your units respond 250% faster. That's really nice. Uh, that could be good on the last wave as well. That's actually really solid. But we don't get any gold, which is fine, especially on the last wave. Why do we want to activate those shrines? Hmm. Hmm. We It only costs two right now. Yeah, I'm going to do that. I'm going to move slower this night. Not the end of the world. But, uh, yeah, we'll do that. 
as well. And I have five. I think we'll build that tower and a house. The houses will pay for themselves after a couple nights, but... Should come, come on, come down. You guys, this way. Oh no. Towers back there should help, especially with the other stuff. Nope. Nice, we got it activated. I'm happy about that. It means more gold. And I'm back to normal speed. So that is solid. All right, we have a big wave up top. That is fine. God, we're getting tons of money too. So what we're going to do is I'm going to do this and that, and we'll upgrade you as well. How many knights do we got? We got three more. It's not bad. That's maxed out, which is actually really, really good. Um, let's go ahead and get some more Berserkers while we're at it. That's already all activated. I'm not worried about any of the other walls. And then you, I can't upgrade till next time. That's okay. We have Archers, which is not Megusas. But let's go ahead and set up... Or how do I want to handle this? Just set up here, here, and we'll set up this one as well. If I can get over there, we want to upgrade those towers. Um, we're just preparing for the final wave, really. Let's go ahead and grab you. You guys are all going to be placed up here. And then all you guys are going to come here with me. Let's do this. Build it right, we can do great damage. Let's make sure come back. The shrines are going to help down there, that's okay. Again, not really worried because we're so far away from our stuff. Um, we should just be, for the most part, destroying everything. And that extra ability that we did for the 25% damage, phenomenal. Like, we didn't die, and we were in the middle of all that. Okay, now this is going to be a wave that we need to prep for. So we're going to go ahead and do this. Now, what do I want for you? Um, <laughs> that could be good. Yeah, we'll do the healing spire on that one, just because we'll put the guys close, and then we have this tower right here to actually do a lot of damage. Like that, so that'll be solid. These are upgraded, but let's go ahead and upgrade this while we're at it. I want you to be a sniper tower, so you can actually shoot the crypt that's here, which will be good. We'll go ahead and just make you a normal tower. You'll start shooting there as well as the ghosts when they come in. 
and it's kind of all she wrote for this way for the most part. Do I want to spend the six here? The second to last wave, so if we did this, right, we could... I don't want that one. All right, we'll do this one, just so we have the big spend on the last wave for those shrines, because that's kind of what I wanted. You guys, you guys are going to come over here like that. You guys can stay there, and I want to at least grab some of you guys to pull down here. In reality, I should probably bring everyone back to center, but uh, let's try this. Hit on. We should have melee resistance and other things going on to help us as they just run the buildings. Not the end of the world, the sanctuary there is pretty solid. Let's go in here though. This is where a lot of this stuff is ending up. If I stand here though, I seem to be good. And those ice bolts should be coming in to do a lot of damage. I don't know if we're cheesing this or not. It's working. I don't dare move closer though, um, for fear of them getting through. And here come the ghosts. This is what I was more concerned about were the ghosts. The things though are finally starting to go away. And those southern ghosts there, down there. Should be being taken care of by everything, I would hope. Yeah, no, we're we're good. It is a rough wave. And we got it. Okay, cool. Now for the crypt. So this is what I'm concerned about. We'll do that. I definitely want to spend the, um, oh, I didn't realize there was stuff down here. Well, there was a mine. Uh, we definitely want to upgrade. Did I fully upgrade that? <laughs> no, I did not. Darn it. And we're definitely going to do this, though. We don't need gold, so I am going to do the Shrine one. Yep, shrines have 300 attack range and activation range. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. it's beautiful. So they're going to be shooting a lot on this guy because there's a lot of shrines. Uh, we do want... Let's try to get more troops. So we want a lot of troops. That's 16. Did I max you out yet? All right, I can only really get one of them. We'll go for archers. And then I will get, we'll try to do fire wing, and we can buy another, oh, that's a house. And we'll buy, let's buy a support mage, do that. All right, entire army, coming to me. Find a wave, let's give it a shot. I should be decently strong as well. And then these towers should be hitting this guy decently hard. But look, I just took out a quarter of his health. I gotta watch my health too.
All right. Looks like we're going to win fairly easily. The shrines are crazy strong. I need to keep moving out of that. Yeah, no, we're going to kill him. He's not going to get anywhere near where he did last time. Especially, oh, the shrine. The shrines are what did it. Yes, the shrines are what did it. Clean that up and give me that victory screen. Yes. All right, so 5,000. 200 for that. Mutator bonus and no restarts. 8,607 score. We're on our way to level 79. Let's go back to the map. Oh, that was a beautiful one. I really like that. And we just collected 40 crowns in total, um, which is an achievement, which is nice. Next time, though, maybe because of that shrine build, we decide to go snake. Where'd snake go? Hold on, where's the easy one? Did they remove easy mode? I think they did. <laughs> there used to be an easy mode one. Where it's like it just made the challenge that much easier to beat. Uh, for everyone to like go, oh, hey, I'm trying to start, I'm trying to learn, trying to get stuff. Now they're all just evil mutators. But yeah, this gives us less gold per enemy drop. Not the end of the world. What I think we want to take advantage of with this one is the fact that we have those summoning posts and the summoning posts are going to allow us to get more gold. Because if you remember, it's like, oh, I killed those three guys, I get seven gold. That's amazing. We're only gonna try to do another build. I don't know if we want to continue that battle axe, although it was really nice. It took a while and there was a lot of research that needed to get done. I am preferencing the pristine warriors again just because they were so good and they destroyed those things. But without the growth god, this is actually gonna be a lot easier because they're gonna be they're gonna be weaker. I just had less gold. But there are a lot of mines we'll want to capitalize on. Maybe um, we go here and get that mine because there's so many mines. I think there's one, two, three, three mines on that map. So that actually might be good for an economy build. Plus, we'll probably want to go this. So we'll figure out all that next time. But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have a fantastic day. Dr. Munchkin, signing out.